calm, it's time to feed. Oh, wow! Rainbow. I just got an idea for a new cape. mixture I prepared this morning. I will add blue and purple food coloring in here. Thank you. 
will roll out and cut the fondant into pieces like this. I also use the mold to create beautiful flowers from fondants. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread blue and purple frosting into each half of the cake. And press gently to set them in place. This bigger cake will be the first layer cake. I will arrange fondant pieces around it in the rainbow color order. I place the smaller one above it, so we have a two-tier cake. I also add many flowers with fondant on two cake tiers. Don't forget the rainbow and clouds. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Why do you buy so many candies? I need them to decorate my cake. Let's see it on Facebook later. Firstly, I add egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. I also put sprinkles here and mix them up. Melt these Kit Kat balls to have dark melted chocolate. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread white frosting around the cake. And press gently to set it in place. Next, 
I place a smaller cake above. I arrange the chocolate bars around the first tier cake like this. And cover the second tier one with many sprinkles. I will use chocolate bars to divide the top of this cake into four parts. I put mandem candies and Kit Kat balls into these parts. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Thank you. We had the flour. Let's make a cake now. I will mix eggs, milk, cooking oil, and sugar here. food coloring because I want to have green cake sponge. and create colorful hearts. Spread the bottom layer with chocolate frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. Smooth it evenly. Then, I pour melted chocolate on the top of this cake. swirls of chocolate buttercream around the edge of the cake. Next, I insert heart sticks into the center of the buttercream swirls in rainbow color order. Arrange the hearts in a rows around the base of the cake like this. Wow! It looks so pretty. I love it. Rainbow, so colorful. Oh, 
I just had an idea. Delicious! This is a magical dairy milk box. So, it costs $5. Quite expensive, but I will buy it. Is she a liar? I will touch them to see if anything magical happens. This is a magical dairy milk box. Wow, so amazing. I will cut and melt this chocolate bar. Next, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. I 
also add melted chocolate here and keep mixing. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake and smooth it in this way. Then, I pour melted chocolate on the top of the cake. I place a special donut in the middle of the top and add some sprinkles around the base of this cake. Delicious! Tasty! Pace, I'm so tired. Now, it's time to use magic. Let's make a cake now. Firstly, I mix flour, cornstarch, and cocoa powder together. After that, I add egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar here and continue mixing. some fondants in the fridge. Our task now is to turn them into fondant balls to decorate the cake later. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake and smooth it in this way. Then, I pour melted chocolate on the top of the cake. I arrange the fondant balls around the base in rainbow color order. The fondant hearts will help me complete the decoration of this cake. Wow! 
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Tasty. Whose money is this? It's mine. Thank you. Would you mind visiting my house and eating a dessert? It's my pleasure. To make a cake for my guest, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together first. flour and strawberry here. Oh no, I did it too hard. Buttercream with butter, sugar, whipping cream. And whisk them up. Buttercream. I really love them. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. Place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread white frosting around the cake. And press gently to set in place. Then, I will pipe rainbow buttercream around the body. of this cake. I have only one cream left in the fridge, so I will use it to decorate the cake. Sprinkles are the final decoration today. Love it. Thank you so much. Wow, I love it. Delicious. Tasty. Hi, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Are you seeing an egg? But it's not a normal one. Wow, so amazing. Let's see what I will do with this magical egg. I will mix flour and cocoa powder first. Next, I add egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar here. And keep mixing. Hi 
Minion. Thanks for your help. I will roll the fondant blocks into thin threads. And create a rainbow. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake like this. Press gently to set it in place. Next, I pipe swirls of rainbow buttercream around the edge. Lots of chocolate buttercream around the base of the cake. I insert the fondant rainbow into the center of the cake. Sprinkles are the final decoration for this cake. It looks so pretty. I love it.
tasty. Sweet. Yummy. Let's put the ice cream in here and start making a cake now. I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Next, I also add flour and cocoa powder here. Our task now is to make them become rainbow fondant balls. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread chocolate frosting around the cake and press gently to set it in place. Then, I arrange the rainbow fondant balls in vertical rows around the cake body. I will pour melted chocolate in rainbow color order on the top of this cake. My favorite ice cream will be the final decoration for the cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Wow, so cool! Tom, look at me. Oh no, I had to make a different cake instead. Oh wow! Thank you. 
Delicious.
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Hi, welcome to my home. Can you help me make something sweet for my friend, please? Okay, wait for me. Firstly, I will cut and melt this chocolate bar. Next, I will make cake batter by mixing egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour. Also add melted chocolate here and keep mixing. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread caramel frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly. Then, I pour melted chocolate around the edge of the cake. I also pour rainbow melted chocolate between melted chocolate lines. I pipe star dots of rainbow buttercream around the edge of this cake. I arrange chocolate chips around the base. And spread chocolate crumbs on top of the cake. Delicious. Tasty. Yummy. Oh, I want, but I don't have a dress. Um. Okay, I will make dress up cake.
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Tasty. Good job, Tom. <laughs> you and you, get out of my house. Sweet! Yummy! Where is the music coming from? Oh no, my mom forgot turning off the radio before leaving. Thanks to that, I found a forgotten chocolate bar. Let's make a cake now. Firstly, I will break and melt this chocolate bar. I 
mix egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar, and flour together. Also add melted chocolate here and keep mixing. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. Next, I pipe chocolate buttercream around the edge. And the base of this cake. Then, I arrange sprinkles on the cake body to make a rainbow. Don't forget to add the clouds with fondant. And these special rainbow chocolate bars. Finally, I spread some sprinkles onto the buttercream swirls on the surface of this cake. It looks so pretty. I love it. Wow, orange. Thank you. It's so fresh.
Wow, I love it! Delicious! Luckily, I need it to make a cake. Let's get started now. To make a cake, I need to mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. I also add flour, cocoa powder here and keep mixing. simple way to make buttercream. Let's whip butter, sugar, whipping cream together. Next, I pour melted chocolate into this buttercream bowl. These two types of buttercream will create another buttercream with a beautiful light brown color. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After all, I spread chocolate frosting all over the cake. And smooth it evenly. Then, I pipe dots of brown, light brown, and white buttercream. Then swipe them to the right to get this effect on the cake body. Finally, I place mandum candies onto the top of this cake. Looks so pretty, I love it.
Lively versions. Make your wish come true right now. Thank you. Making vegetables with fondant is not too difficult. You just need to follow my steps. Insert the leaf stems with green fondant to the top of red fondant balls and we have tomatoes. Same with carrots, just change the color and shape. Making yellow bell peppers is not much different. Finally, here are the steps to make cove beans. Spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread purple frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. I use green buttercream and Oreo crumbs to create a little garden on top of the cake. Then, I stick the vegetables on top of this garden plot. White fondant fences will help keep this garden safe. Small flowers will make the garden more sparkling. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Breaking my heart.
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Tasty. sleep anymore. Come here, I need your help. Go buy a watermelon. We're almost out of them. First, I will dice the watermelon, carrot, mango, and avocado. them in a blender to get the juices. When hot water is poured into dried butterfly pea flowers, they will fade to a blue color. Then, squeeze a few drops of lemon here, the water will turn purple color. Next, I boil the watermelon juice with sugar, milk, and honey. This step is done when the mixture becomes sticky. I also do the same with other juices. Then, I melt the jelly powder in the microwave. Now, I pour the melted jelly into each jam bowl and mix them up. After that, I pour them into a globular mold and let it cool in 30 minutes. wrong. But it's okay. I have a new idea. I cut a lemon in half and remove the intestines. Next, I draw the black lines on the lemon peels to make them look like a watermelon. Delicious. Tasty. Good morning. I need something to fill my stomach. 
Oh, Kit Kat chocolate. Still Kit Kats. Lots of Kit Kats. Okay, I will make a cake with Kit Kat chocolate. Delicious. Oh no, I don't have money. Let me make you something delicious. Firstly, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. powder here and keep mixing. So I will make them become many fondant balls. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. Thank you. 
I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. rainbow fondant balls around the cake base. I also arrange the chocolate bars above the fondant rows. Next, I pipe swirls of rainbow buttercream around the edge of the cake. fondant balls in the center of the buttercream swirls. Wow. It looks so pretty. I love it. Stole my rainbow. Delicious. Tasty. What should I draw now? You're so naughty, Tom. Get out. But these lines are quite interesting. They will appear on my cake today. Firstly, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and honey together. I also 
also add flour, cocoa powder here and keep mixing. Roll out the fondant blocks. And cut them into pieces like this. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. After that, I press gently to set it in place. Next, I arrange the fondant pieces around the cake body in rainbow color order. Then, I pipe swirls of rainbow buttercream around the edge of the cake. At the end, I insert a rainbow on the top of this cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Thank you! Hey, Tom, watch my performance! It's time to make a cake.
Wow, I love it. Delicious. Tasty. There are road works ahead. You can't go through that. Um, can you help me deliver this egg? Okay. Thank you. Thanks for your help. Now, I mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Next, I put flour, rhubarb powder here and continue mixing. I'll move on to making the rainbow fondant balls. It is a simple process. I just need to break the fondants into small pieces. And roll them into the balls. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I pipe lines of rainbow frosting from the base to the top of the cake. And smooth them evenly. I pour melted chocolate over the top of the cake and let it flow down the cake body. Finally, I put the rainbow fondant balls in vertical rows on the cake surface. It looks so pretty. I love it. My chocolate is delivered already. Let's make a cake with me now. Firstly, I break and melt this white chocolate bar. Now, I move on to making the cake batter. I will mix egg, milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. Also add flour and matcha powder here. Thank you. 
the melted white chocolate, I'll mix in some food coloring to create rainbow melted chocolate. I spread the bottom layer with white frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. After that, I spread white frosting all over the cake and smooth it evenly. Next, I pour rainbow melted chocolate on the top of the cake. rainbow fondant balls around the cake base. Finally, I insert a heart with fondant and sprinkles on the top of this cake. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Good jobs, Nick and Milo. I will make something delicious for you guys. Firstly, I chop watermelon, orange, mango, and avocado one by one on the cutting board. Then, I put them in the blender one by one to get the juices. To create the blue color, I soak dried butterfly pea flowers in hot water. And create the purple color by squeezing a few drops of lime here. Boil the milk with the gelatin powder and sugar until they become a sticky mixture. I pour the gelatin mixture into the juice bowls and stir them well. jelly mixture into these two molds one by one in rainbow color order. Wow. It looks so pretty. I love it. Today, I will guide you to make a beautiful dessert. It is Swiss Rainbow Roll Cake. First, I mix egg milk, cooking oil, and sugar together. I 
also add flour and corn stacker into the cake batter. After that, I add food coloring to have rainbow cake batter. Now I pour the cake batter into the molding rainbow color order. I take the fondant out of the fridge. and shape them into round balls. Next, I spread white frosting on top of the cake. After that, I scroll it into a roll cake. Finally, I arrange rainbow fondant balls in diagonal lines on the cake surface. Wow, I love it! Delicious! Tasty! Jackpot game. I love it. Yay! I win. This is the winner's reward. Oh, thank you.
tasty. Sweet! Yummy! signal to remind me to make a cake now. Firstly, I put egg, milk, cooking oil, sugar into a bowl and mix them up. I also add flour and Oreo crumbs in here and keep mixing. Chocolate chips. And pour melted chocolate into the mold. I spread the bottom layer with chocolate frosting and add the first layer on. I place the remaining cake layer over the frosting. I spread chocolate frosting around the cake. I press gently to set it in place. Next, I arrange chocolate bars around the cake like this. After that, I pipe sharp swirls of chocolate buttercream around the edge of the cake. candies and Oreo will be the final decoration for this cake. It looks so pretty. I love it. Thank you. 
Tasty. Sweet. Yummy.